Wesley Trent Snipes is an American actor and martial artist. Snipes has made films in a variety of genres, such as numerous thrillers, dramatic feature films, and comedies, though he is best known for his action films. Born, July 31, 1962, age 62 years, Orlando, Florida, United States. Children, Jelani Asar Snipes, Iset Juati Snipes, Akhenaten Kiwati Snipes, Alafia Jut Snipes, Alamayamoa T. Snipes. Spouse, Nakey Young Park, M. 2003, April Du Bois, M. 1985-1990. Height, 1.75 meters. Parents, Marion Snipes, Wesley R. Snipes. Siblings, Wesley Quinton Rudy Snipes, Bridget Snipes. Wesley Trent Snipes was born in Orlando, Florida, to Marion, Long, a teacher's assistant, and SMSGT Wesley Rudolph Snipes, an aircraft engineer. He grew up on the streets of the South Bronx in New York City, where he very early decided that dance and the theater were to be his career. He attended the High School for the Performing Arts, popularized in fame, 1980, but dreams of the musical theater, and maybe a few commercials, faded when his mother moved to Orlando. Florida before he could graduate. Fortune would have it that he, along with two friends in his drama class, teachers Mr. S. Poro and K. Ruggiero, would start a bus and truck theater company, Strutton Street Stuff, be instrumental in his high schools, Jones High, induction into the International Thespian Society, Orlando Chapter and help lay the foundation for what would become Dr. Phillips High School's theater arts program. Musical theater rooted Snipes performed song and dance, puppetry, and acrobatics in city parks, dinner clubs, and performing arts centers around central Florida. As a recipient of a Victor Borge scholarship, Snipes left Orlando and entered the world-renowned professional theater arts program at SUNY Purchase in New York, now Purchase College, where he honed his theatrical performance and martial arts skills. Graduating with a BFA, he went on to co-star in a few soap operas and nighttime dramas, peppered in between critical acclaim performances Broadway. It was there in a Broadway theater an agent saw him on stage and invited him to audition for his first feature film role, Goldie Hawn Wildcats, 1986. Athletic roles such as that gave way to dramatic roles such as that gave way to tough guy roles as in New Jack City, 1991, and to the action hero in Passenger 57, 1992. Wesley feels that at least with the Hollywood heavyweights he must be doing something right. Sylvester Stallone, Robert De Niro, Dennis Hopper and Sean Connery all had veto power over casting, and all approved his role. Wesley also founded Amon Raw Films Production Company, and is a multi-system combat arts black belt holder at Technologist and VC. Family, Spouses, Nakian, Nikki, Park, March the 17th, 2003, Present, Four Children, April Du Bois, 1985, 1990, divorced, one child, children, Jelani Asar Snipes, Alafia Jehu T. Snipes, Akhenaten Kua T. Snipes, Alimu Moa T. Snipes, Iset Jua T. Snipes, parents, Wesley Rudolph Snipes, Marianne Snipes, long, trademarks, characters in his films, usually his own characters, frequently quote the literary classic, The Art of War, written by Sun Tzu around 500 BCE, which is widely regarded as the single best resource for training military special forces groups worldwide. Deep commanding voice. His incredible martial arts skill. Trivia. Was Sylvester Stallone's original choice to play Hail Caesar in The Expendables, 2010, but couldn't accept because of his tax issues made him unable to leave the United States. His apartment in NYC was destroyed by the collapse of the World Trade Center's Twin Towers. He happened to be on the West Coast with his wife, Nikki Park taking care of their daughter, who was born on his birthday on the West Coast. He is a fifth-degree black belt in Shotokan Karate. He also studied Kung Fu and has a second-degree black belt in Hapkido, ninth dan in the Kushinderyu in Karate, fifth dan in Sanus's Ryu Jujutsu, and a ninth dan in Weaponry. On April 18, 2005, Snipes filed a suit against New Line Cinema for more than $5 million, claiming that the studio failed to pay the balance of his fixed rate for Blade, Trinity, and that he wasn't allowed to approve the director. Per his contract stipulations, his close friends with Woody Harrelson has appeared in Michael Jackson's music video Michael Jackson, Bad, 1987. You can only see him in the full-length, 
16 minute black and white color music video it is usually shortened down to just the color segment for television married korean artist nikki park who is the mother of his four youngest children in march 2003 snipe spends a great deal of time in park's home country which he calls his second home is a fanatical music lover and collector and owns more than 1000 lps and 4000 cds has mastered numerous martial arts forms including the brazilian street fighting form capoeira the character of raven from tekken 5 2004 was modeled after him insisted that the role of mimi played by ming na wen his character's wife in the film One Night Stand, 1997, be played by an Asian woman, in order to push the boundaries of racial sexual taboos. Snipe's character, Max, is a successful black commercial director, who has an extramarital affair with an attractive blonde, Nastasia Kinski, was set to star in Major League II, 1994, reprising his role of Willie Mays Hayes, but gave up the project due to schedule conflicts. The role was recast with Omar Epps, received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, at 7018 Hollywood Boulevard in Hollywood, California on August 21, 1998. He attended the State University of New York at Purchase. He joins the other notable SUNY Purchase attendees, who include Parker Posey, Sherry Stringfield, Melissa Leo, Stanley Tucci, directors Hal Hartley and Nick Gomez, and producers Todd Baker and Bob Goss. He left Purchase and transferred to a school in Florida, where he graduated with a Bachelor of Fine Arts in 1985. He served a prison sentence at the Federal Correctional Institution McKean, in Pennsylvania, for misdemeanor failure to file U.S. federal income tax returns. His period of incarceration was from December 9, 2010 to April 2, 2013, along with a house arrest period ending on July 19. 2013 you can see him reading a book on the plane in his big action film passenger 57 1992 the book is the art of war which is the same title as a movie that he starred in eight years later though unrelated to it ranked the 10th most popular movie star in america by the annual harris poll 1999 father retired from united states air force reserves 315 at charleston air force base april 1998 with the rank of msgt Seven Degrees Martial Arts Master, father of son Jelani Asar Snipes, born 1988, with first wife, April. Introduction and training in the martial arts was first by fellow classmate, and now fight co-coordinator, technical advisor Marcus Salgado. He has black belts in Shotokan Karate, and Hapkido and is trained in Capoeira, Kung Fu, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, Wushu, Taekwondo and Kickboxing. Publicly blasted John Singleton for not casting him in the title role in Shaft, 2000. Snipes claims the film would have made twice its $60 million plus earnings had he been cast. World Martial Arts Hall of Fame, member, chosen by People magazine as one of the 50 most beautiful people, in the world, 1991. Father of sons Alafia Jehu T. Snipes, Akhenaten Kua T. Snipes, Alimi Moa T. Snipes, born March 26, 2007 and daughter Aset Jua T. Snipes, born July 31, 2001, with wife Nakiang Park. He turned down a role in Do the Right Thing, 1989, in order to star in Major League, 1989, was set to star in Miracle at St. Anna, 2008, but had to leave the project due to tax problems, which made him unable to travel to Italy, the film's principal shooting location. His intended role went to Derek Luke, listed as one of twelve promising new actors of 1990 in John Willis Screen World Vol 42 November the 11th 2008 attended the star-studded opening of Dube's lavish Atlantis Palms Resort guests were welcomed in style with a display of 1 million fireworks said to be visible from space earlier in his career he auditioned for certain films including for the leading role of Leroy Green in The Last Dragon 1985 Godfather of actress Kashal El Chantiel, BF of Fine Arts, quotes, Lot of the scripts I've been in with other non-white actors haven't been great. Lot of non-white actors ain't all that great. On marriage, I don't understand the mandate of being together forever. The idea that you should do that is wrong. It makes us slaves to a societal mandate. You can still love, but it doesn't mean you have to be tethered to the flesh. 9.14.97, Toronto Sun Newspaper, interviewed by Liz Braun. I read that Asian women were bedroom generals. Some people think that means they're great in bed, but that's not the issue. They're talking about a place where the man is at his most vulnerable, 
where they have the most control. They don't have to beat him over the head to mow the lawn. They can whisper it in his ear and give him a kiss on the cheek and it's no problem. That's a general. August 1998. Jet Magazine V.90 for pound 13 PG.58. Certain roles are more challenging than others. But I haven't come across one yet that I can't tackle. I have a great deal of fun playing Blade. The lifestyle of it, the controlled rebelliousness, is wonderful to me. And it's therapeutic, too. A role like this lets you vent. I never really planned on making action films. It just kind of happened. I focus primarily on acting and developing characters, but that has blossomed into a whole new venue. I'm still young and fit enough to do. My love is still drama, though. Even if I play a straight action guy, I want to give him some depth and substance. On why he loves the sport of boxing, I love the idea of the man-to-man -man against one another. I like that. I don't know why. His advice to aspiring actors, they should be very versatile. Versatility is what's going to give them the longevity. The world is opening up and a lot more stories and a lot more interesting scenes to portray in film. Versatility will help them. They must be able to see the world, learn the world, and bring it to their craft. 2010, GQ Magazine, you know, when I was doing films like White Men, Can't Jump, 1992, and the money was hefty, I didn't get it. I didn't know what you could do with it. Like, I've never been to Hawaii. I didn't know. I had no experience in, let's take some money and go to Hawaii and rent a chalet and live it up and champagne and da da da, so I didn't go anywhere. I didn't do anything. I'm not saying I didn't have fun, but I didn't have the fun you would expect for a person, who for all intents and purposes hit the lottery. I didn't do all the movie star Hollywood things. Salaries. Blade. Trinity. 2004. 13 million dollars. Blade. 1998. 8 million dollars. Murder at 1600. 1997. 10 million dollars. The Fan. 1,996, 7 million dollars. Money Train, 1,995, 5 million 500 thousand dollars. Drop Zone, 1,994, 7 million dollars. Demolition Man, 1,993, 4 million dollars. Wildcats, 1,986, 30 thousand dollars. <laughs>